Do you know what chemicals are in your child's toys, food? How about their bottles and pacifiers? Well, it turns out that many substandard and often harmful chemicals are way more present in these things than you might think. But hopefully not for long. And joining me in the studio with more is Timmy Berkovich, the vice president of Be Free. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank and you. I see you have some interesting products yep. here, a bottle of sorts. Mm -hmm. um, so, so tell us a little bit about what you have created here. Well, we have a family business which my father started about 15 years ago. Uh, we're actually the first company to talk about the issue of bisphenol A, which is a chemical that disrupts hormones and um, development of different things in, in a baby's uh, body. Now, this chemical is known to, to make some really bad things like cancer, uh, fertility problems, all sorts of bad stuff. And this is a chemical that is in many bottles? It that... used to be in all the bottles. Wow. Uh, okay. When my father came across this information almost 20 years ago, on that day he decided not to sell that plastic, and that's where the name Be Free comes from. Interesting. Um, so, so free our, of bisphenol A. You say. Right. Okay. So it's also bis free of bisphenol A, but our bottle also prevents uh, babies from swallowing air, uh, it prevents gas, so it's free from gas, free from... And that can lead to inf ear infections, right, can as lead well? to ear infections. Yeah. The ear infections can be caused from the vacuum that's being built up in a regular bottle. Mm -hmm. Our bottle basically prevents the vacuum from getting built up inside by this new patent that we just res registered now. Um, this wow. is our older product that we've been selling for years under uh, different brands. In the States it was sold under the Born Free brand. Again, prevents all the vacuum. This is a new and, version. And you have more yeah. than bottles as well, right? right you have right. some other products? We have products? pacifiers, we okay. have uh, cups, we have sterilizers, breast pumps, all sorts of things. And it's all made in Israel. Well, I think is... what's very interesting about these products is just kind of spreading awareness about some of the chemicals right. that you could end up um, right. you know, finding in the products that you're buying for your babies, right. um, which is really, really scary. So where can we find these products for those of our viewers who are interested? Today, we, we are in a relaunch of this uh, brand because it used to be sold under the Born rebrand in the States. Mm -hmm. So in, in America now, it's uh, you can find it on Amazon until it reaches the shelves. And here uh, in Israel? In Israel, you can find it all the, you know, uh, different pharmacies and uh, baby shops. And it's all right. Well, Israel's everywhere. already ahead of the, uh, the curve yeah, on this Yeah, well, one. this is our home court, so Absolutely. We, we hope to do a better job, as, uh, as, as good a job as we can in Israel. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much for joining us, Timmy. Thank and uh, for those of you who are interested in, in protecting your children, this is probably the product that you should be aiming for, right? Definitely. <laughs> thank all you. All right.